In order to ensure optimal long-term performance of your treadmill, the belt and deck must be lubricated periodically. If you have the required materials, please follow the process shown in this video for lubricating your belt and deck. Disconnect the treadmill power cord. The tubing should already be connected to the syringe tip. If it is not, affix it with super glue or hot glue. Unscrew the silicone oil bottle cap and cut the tip to make an opening wide enough to insert the tubing into the bottle. It may be necessary to enlarge the hole slightly with a sharp tool. Insert the tube into the silicone bottle and draw 10 milliliters into the syringe. It may be difficult to fill the syringe the first time. After the tube is coated internally, subsequent fillings will be easier. Some air in the syringe is okay. From either side of the belt, and as close to the front of the deck as possible, carefully insert the tube under the running belt surface, between the belt and deck, until the tube tip reaches the middle of the width of the belt. While slowly squeezing silicone from the syringe, keep the tube tip near the center of the belt, and move it toward the rear of the deck, wiggling it slightly as you go. Step onto the running surface, and push the belt with your feet to move it one half revolution. Use the belt seam as a reference. With an additional 10 milliliters of silicone oil, repeat the process on the remaining portion of the belt. Restore power to the treadmill, and without walking on the belt, start a manual workout. Allow the treadmill to run for 3 minutes. Stay off the belt during this time. Step onto the belt and set the treadmill to a comfortable walking pace. Walk on the belt for another 3 minutes to spread the oil. This completes the lubrication maintenance of your treadmill. Record the treadmill mileage and date of maintenance for easy reference.